10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top. Allumage Vulcain. Allumage des EAP et décollage. saying, my God, fabulous. Wonderful shots into the blue, blue sky. Very good shot. In daylight. Something we don't see every day. We hope you enjoy that. We'll have some replays at the end of the broadcast, and you can see it again. 770, 770 tons lifting off at uh, H0. Yes, we now hear the, the, the noise coming from the launch pad, arriving here at the uh, vicinity of the Launch Control Center. Takes over, a minute, takes over a minute, takes to, over a minute to, to make to, the 14 yeah, kilometers. To, yeah, to make the 14 kilometers. So what's happening now? We have the first so, of the power uh, flight phases, the boosters yes, and these, the core engine. The two solid boosters give a very strong initial boost that will increase velocity from zero to, to 7,200 kilometers per hour, let's say 4,500 miles per hour approximately 20% of the targeted final velocity. The DDO had just said that all parameters of the flight are nominal. So we're doing fine. We have, uh, we're into the first powered flight phase. Ariane has three powered flight phases, and one is unpowered. We'll describe each of them in turn, so you can follow her along on her trajectory. Right now, as we mentioned, the two solid boosters and the core main engine are burning. Yes, they're for 2.3 minutes, uh, so uh, burn of the solid boosters. Boosters should burn out in about 10 seconds. You'll probably be able to see that because the skies are clear unless she disappears into the clouds. <laughs> and after separation, we shall have lost 75% uh, of the mass at liftoff. Separation, accélération à poudre. Right on time. The boosters, the DDO has called out the booster oh, we have separation. This is what it looks like up there. There's two of them that fall away. The other one is out of the well, camera. Gorgeous right. images from the uh, separation. 